we talked about how Art Bryles, you know, is he going to coach again? Big question. That's a big question because of what has happened over at Baylor and the reason he's gone. Now, he's been out of football for less than three months after the scandal at Baylor led to his departure, but he still has a hard time coming to grips that the season is starting without him on the sidelines. Quote, I'm dumbfounded and trying to process everything as it goes, but it is what it is. Reality is reality, and so what I've got to do is redefine myself and start a new chapter. And that's what I'm doing. Bryles visited Dallas Cowboys training camp on Tuesday and spent time watching with uh, watching practice with owner and general manager Jerry Jones. And the Cowboys were the fifth camp Bryles has visited this summer as he watched the Los Angeles Rams uh, on Monday. I also saw some of his former players with the Cleveland Browns uh, and, Cincinnati, and he went to Cincinnati Bengals and the Tennessee Titans camps. And Bryles said he will have more of a chance to explain his version of what transpired at Baylor, but he has uh, learned some lessons, which I would hope so. And I don't understand this whole thing of he's going to explain his version. There is only one version, and we've seen what has happened at Baylor and what has continued to happen even after everything that was going on. Baylor had another player that the coaches knew about, the athletic department knew about, that raped another woman and still let him play football last year. Woo! But, of course, the head coach never knows when something, when a personal problem, when a, a, a big-time crime problem happens at a university, the head coach never knows about his players. But if he misses class, if he misses practice, if he misses uh, something that's going to relate to football, he's going to know. He's on top of it. Come on, Bryles. Now, Bryles hopes to return to coaching as soon as next season, saying, quote, I hope November, December, that's the plan. Unfortunately, some job will come open. Uh, oh, yeah, never mind. Uh, I've never rooted against anybody or any team, but that's the nature of the business. So we'll have to see when that happens. But like I said, it's going to be a new journey, and I'm excited to take it. I really am. Okay. Okay. Uh, he does not believe the fallout from the scandal will affect his chances of landing a new job. Uh, quote, because I know who I am. I know what I've been for 60 years. So people may doubt what you say, but they'll always believe what you do. And I've always lived in a, <laughs> my life in a righteous manner. End quote. That's right. We're going to probably doubt what you say, but we're going to believe in what you did and what you let, what you, what cr culture you allowed in the locker room and at the university. I mean, I'm not the only one that feels this way. So I don't know. Now, now he's got a little bit of backup though, which is terrible. Now, Bryles has a close relationship with the Cowboys. His daughter, Jancy, works or worked in the team's public relations department for years. How ironic is that? Uh, is the owner and general manager, Jerry Jones, said Bryles has a standing invitation to visit practice whenever he wants. And Jones believe he will coach, uh, that believes Bryles will coach again soon. Quote, he's a peer with his peers. Certainly, I think he would be a great asset to an organization at any level, at any level. He's a football coach. He understands talent and evaluates talent. He also went on to say that he would serve as a reference for Bryles if needed while acknowledging he does not condone the wrongdoings at Baylor. Quote, I would vouch for him as a person. He's a top quality person. I would want my grandson if he had a chance to play for him. Wow. Wow. Jerry Jones. Now, Jerry Jones has... Uh, He's ha he has a, a little bit of, uh, I guess, a reputation of allowing people who have uh, domestic assaults, sexual assaults, uh, and allowing them to be a part of his organization, as we've seen for not just with Greg Hardy, but s several years. You go back all the way since he's been there. Now he's uh, basically allowing a sexual assault enabler in our Bryles to... Hey, I'd vouch for him. 
at any school, wherever you want to go. You can put me down as a reference. Man, that's a problem. That's a problem. But I'm going to ask that same question again. And we got some good comments uh, on, on, on the video uh, that we posted on YouTube. We had some good comments on there uh, for both sides of whether our brawls will coach again or, or if he won't. I'm going to ask it again. Do you believe Art Bryles will coach college football again? And when I say again, uh, I should say roughly next season. Do you believe he gets a job by November or December at some program? Do you believe he coaches college football or even high school football, God forbid, sometime soon? Let me know in the comments.